Many triad school districts still have positions to fill, but the need isn't only for teachers. WFMY News 2's Jenna Kurzina spoke to the triad's second largest school district. Jenna, they have hundreds of job openings. Julie Winston, Salem Forsyth County Schools Chief HR Officer says the education field is no different than other businesses struggling to hire. It isn't easy, but they're working hard to get new employees into schools. It's a very challenging time to be part of a school district. Right. Jevelyn Bonner Reed is the Chief Human Resource Officer for Winston Salem Forsyth County Schools. She says the district is working with 345 job openings in 20 days until the first day of school. The jobs vary but include some of the most critical roles. There are 120 teacher openings, 50 to 60 bus drivers, and 120 cafeteria staff. Those are um, the ones we're zeroing in on the most. Reed says teachers and bus drivers are no surprise. The need for child nutrition workers is high, though. It just was not a full year of because of being in and out of, of the COVID situation for child nutrition workers. So now we're back to needing that fully staffed and we're competing against uh, McDonald's against all these other food service organizations that have really increased their pay. Winston-Salem Forsyth County Schools isn't the only district with openings. According to Guilford County Schools website, they have nearly 800. And the Alamance Burlington School System website shows around 320. It is a strain, but also we, we saw it coming. I have confidence that we'll have the right people in the right places the day one of school. Winston-Salem Forsyth County Schools is looking into additional sign-on bonuses for specific high-need roles in schools. They are still working to finalize what it might be, but it will focus on retention.